Virginia football game tomorrow. Yep. And I point that out because this morning's Coffee With is with the athletic director of the University of Maryland, Kevin Anderson, and the lady who started and maintains Casey Cares, Casey Baines. Ladies and gentlemen, it is really an honor. Kevin, Casey, welcome to the Eyewitness News the double shake Morning here. Edition. It, it really, really is. Uh, Kevin, we'll, def we'll defer to uh, Casey here right off the get-go. I don't fault you for that. I understand that. <laughs> it, it is so cool to have you here. You are really, you're the real. When somebody says that to you, is it embarrassing? How does it make you feel? It seems bizarre, a little awkward, because I just have always believed so heavily in giving back. Um, even when I was in high school, that was just part of my life. So, so many people are like, oh gosh, Casey cares. You help hundreds and hundreds of people and thousands of families. How do you do it? Why do you do it? That's just the way I was raised. That's what you're and supposed to do. And it's possible do. people at this point don't know that you borrowed money to start the foundation. Right. You went into debt. You didn't have money you borrowed money to give away. Absolutely. Nobody does that. I mean, I'm the first off, I'm, <laughs> first off, I'm surprised you could even get the money to do that. Well, it was, um, I had the idea to start Casey Cares when I was in my 20s, early 20s, actually late teens. And um, my husband and I weren't quite married yet, but I remember going to him and saying, hey, I've got this great idea. And went through it all, told him what I had found out from social workers and physicians, and shared some of the stories when I spoke mm -hmm. to the families. And I was like, I think we can do it for $2,500. 2500 bucks." And he's like... Well, but what about our school loans, and we're getting married, and it's like, I know, but, you know, let's think this through. And um, he agreed. He said, that sounds like a fantastic you're idea. You're new to the area. You ever heard of anybody doing that before? No, Starting a foundation with Barry? The story that uh, Casey has and she shares, it's just uh, unbelievable. And that's why we wanted to be part of it, the University of Maryland and the athletic department, because our young people are so blessed, and they've got their health and everything. And so for them to share that with these young people, People that are ill it just uh, you know it's it's a great partnership so is this a marriage here well another marriage fact, I think is I think it's a very <laughs> a very darn good marriage there's a guy named Kevin Plank maxed out a credit card to start a company like Under Armour you maxed you basically maxed out your loan potential to start a charity I mean, it's, 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 it's just it's almost staggering and and both have become, you know, Under Armour speaks for itself. Casey Care speaks for itself. I mean, I guess where there's a goal, a will, a want, and a desire, nothing can stop you. Absolutely. And when you get to see the smiles on the faces and hear the parents tell you how you have saved their lives, not medically, but giving them something to look forward to, giving them their childhood, because childhood is too short well, to it? be forgotten or lost. Boy, well, isn't it? And we want to make sure that no child that is critically ill in our area ever has to lose out on their childhood. And I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're all going to do a web action. We're going to get more into Casey Cares the, uh, and talk about the University of Maryland's now association with Casey Cares. But what we want to talk about here on the air is this great event you've got coming up. Let's, Absolutely. Let, let's talk about this. Yes. this cool. And it's on a, a Sunday where the Ravens play a 4 o'clock game against Seattle. So, Raven fans, you can participate. You can hang out. You can help. You can contribute. And have your cake and eat it, too. Watch the Ravens kick the Seahawks. We're around at 4 o'clock. I think it's here on Levy Jay-Z. Oh, let's go ahead and talk about it. Absolutely. It is our second annual 5K. We have a great run. And then, of course, we have a jammy jog and a family run. We're also going to all be entertained by the a Grammy-nominated band Milkshake. Milkshake. Everybody so, Milkshake, huh? Yeah. They are a great group of people, so supportive of Casey Cares. And they're going to be there to help us out again on November 13th. At uh, Pulse Health and Fitness is where we are from. And then we're going to go down York Road and come back to some refreshments and, of course, awards. And if you go to the Casey Cares website, all you got to do is do a search for Casey Cares. And you'll get right to the website. Uh, you'll see the banner talking about this event. But once you just click about and get into the history, it's. I remember covering. Mm -hmm. We covered the fire. It basically put you guys out of business for what ten minutes. <laughs> you start working from your cars across the street in a yeah. parking lot. Yeah, it was devastating. Uh, who would have thought? Um, it happened two days after my thirtieth birthday, so I will uh, definitely remember that one forever and ever. But it was over two hundred firefighters, and it was only because I was able to realize when a family came to visit at the site of the fire that it was the heart of the organization was still alive. What we lost. Was 
walls, files. That's it. The heart was still alive in the families we help. It's pretty cool. When we get online, we're really going to get into the University of Maryland tie in here. And I'm going to tell you why. It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's huge when... It's huge when an organization the size of the University of Maryland Athletic Department, the athletic director, gets behind this. That's ginormous. And you guys are really, I mean, talk about taking the, taking the program out of College Park and bringing it home. Please join us online, WJZ.com. Kevin, thanks so much Thank for being you. here, bud. Casey, Thank thanks you. for being here. we got Sharon Jabal with WJZ TV, Traveling Drill, First Warning Weather, and more coming up next.